Hello Taurus, welcome to your What You Need to Know Today reading. Let's go ahead and find out what Taurus needs to know today. What does Taurus need to know today? Alrighty, so we have man holding a coin. Wow, 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 wow. Oh my, Taurus, what's going on? Okay, man holding a coin. Kind of a king of pentacles, but not quite. A um, man holding a coin can be someone in the workplace. This is, um, could also be someone that you've been waiting to receive action from, some kind of movement. Okay, doors are opening regarding someone that's coming forth. Um, this could be, like I said, someone in the workplace. It could be someone that is a business owner, someone very financially minded, very stable and secure, opening a doorway to unlock the heart. See how we got the, the heart? It's in a cage and the key is there. Um, but it looks like the heart is, um, the cage is opened. Uh, the the hearts are not caged in, but the lock the key is right there, and the lock is on the heart itself. So yet to be unlocked, um, and taking action forward. Oh my, that's exciting! We got three, three, uh, three and three is six. Uh, love is in harmony, also a harmonious in sync uh, amalgamation of energies uh, but because it's three three they're still in separation okay unfortunately so but not for long not for long this heart is going to be unlocked very soon this person whether that's you Taurus or someone around you yet to come into your into your consciousness into your experience going to take action and this one moving into the seven one seven is eight so one moving into the seven it's something you've been waiting for four and three is seven so who is this man holding a coin by the way Taurus if you like my content please like it and if you'd like to receive customized um, notifications of my uploads you can do so by customizing with the bell and then you customize which videos you'd like to be notified for um, i.e your um, zodiac sign and if you like to cross watch again we got seven of pentacles something that you've been waiting for there's a heavy um heavy kind of energy of You've been waiting for this. This is something that you've been really wanting. Uh, whether it's like, I'm so sick of dating apps, I'm so sick of going out, meeting someone and they're totally not my type, you know, or something along those lines. I, I'm getting that vibe. I'm sick of, you know, um, kissing frogs type energy. And for the gents out there, I'm sick of the girls not look, looking like their profile pictures or... I'm sick of the girls not, you know, fitting uh, what what they've been saying who they are or whatever it may be. It's about, you know, I'm waiting for someone that actually fits uh, who is my other, the missing piece of me. Uh, and I feel this is what you've been waiting for. The element of investment, I feel that you've been investing in yourself, in who you are, who you want to attract uh do you know what i mean like by taking care of yourself you're thinking that i want to attract someone who's taking care of themselves in the same way by exercising or by eating well or by you know speaking positively you you've got the the mindset of by doing this this is who i want to attract and this is kind of the investment that i'm getting this is kind of you know, and this could be you or this could be your person soon to come and, and unlock your heart and the two threes, they fit. You are a perfect fit to each other in sync, in harmony, the missing piece to each other's puzzle. Um, it, it's going to be really beautiful. Okay, door to romance. Spirit, please clarify door to romance for my Taurus. 
Please clarify door to romance for my Taurus. Please clarify door to romance. I see the three of swords, meaning that um, you're kind of been longing for this. It's like finally it's about time. I'm so tired of you know waiting or I'm so sick and tired. It's the tower. Wow, it's gonna happen like that. Like how? Like that. <laughs> it's serious. This is a tower where everything this person is going to be a complete shift and turnover in your life. But, you know, I think this is really welcome. This is something like, yeah, finally, you know, I'm willing to make changes. The changes have been so long awaited and I've just been really hanging out for this. Spirit, tell me about action. Don't worry, I'll clarify these. Tell me about action for my gorgeous Taurus watching this and cross watches. You're all welcome. I love you all equally. Spirit, tell me about action for my Taurus. Ooh. All right, there's a fair few cards. We've been working on, and I feel working on ourselves. I feel we have been. The King of Wands, uh, sorry, Knight of Wands, uh, maybe the King, I don't know. Um, but the Knight of Wands, you know, sort of uh, exploring options, you know, thinking about, you know, I'd really like to, you know, put myself out there, you know, and, and see who's out and who's available and who, you know, I guess I'm compatible with, you know, uh, leaving options open uh, and being the Knight of Wands, possibly going from one suitor to another, um, considering, you know, maybe this is my, my last one, maybe this is the final date, you know, and after this, it's going to be the one. Um, and this is, you know, literally looking towards the future. I feel there's a fast flowing energy also uh, coming towards you, Taurus. Uh, and this one is the one that you're going to accept and take. Uh, this one is going to make a difference. This, this is something different. Uh, and they're going to take you by storm. It's going to be vibes all over the place. We've got the Queen of Wands taking control. And once again, I've got the vibe that you've been taking care of yourself. You've been really feeling good about who you are and, you know, where you're headed in life, taking control, sunny side up, staying positive, no matter how, how many knocks you get, you know, how, how many times you get pushed down, you always jump back up. Even if it takes a bit longer to get back up there, you're doing it, Taurus, because you're a goer, you're a total achiever and you, and you just know it and you know how to rebuild and reconstruct and re rehabilitate yourself uh, into a space of I'm going to keep going I'm going to take action I'm moving forward uh, and there's two horses here and I feel this person um, is kind of like an opposite opposites attract I mean you've got black and white here but you fit each other very well temperance this is you holding back I, I need to really, but holding back, but coming together as well. Um, and the reason is Queen of Swords. I've been hurt so many times. This may be a slight caution to you, Taurus. You know, um, stay the sunny side up as opposed to Queen of Swords where you come across as, you know, um, if you're going to come too close, you need you better be ready for, you know, a third, third degree type energy. It's like, don't, don't go too far into the third degree try and um, take it a little bit easy on yourself you know as opposed to you know uh, worrying and placing too much pressure on yourself um, a spirit might be saying to calm this energy um, you know to move forward keep the ones um, vibrant uh, you know, stay stay in your passion zone um, and, and to control and hold back on the Queen of Swords energy. Male and female, gents, you too, try and stay, you know, a sunny side up, you know, try and um, stay focused on the, the passion as opposed to, you know, the swords going deep into your head and, and saying, well, if you're going to come forth, you better, you better be worth my time because I've been through this and this and this. 
um, I guess, avoiding placing a label upon uh, someone that is a possible suitor and possibly the forever after, you know, um, moving forward as the Queen of Wands or King of Wands type. So let's get into this. Let's find out what Seven of Pentacles actually means for you, Taurus. Spirit, tell me more about Seven of Pentacles for my Taurus, please. If you'd like a personal reading, you can always reach out to me at my email address in the description box below and you can find out my most recent obsessions. I've got everything down there. We have making a decision. Ooh, three, zero. Okay, so possibly we've entered a third party. We've entered a situation of a decision. And the reason why I say third party, and I think you all know by now my take on third parties is not oh your person's got another partner that's not my take on third party third party can be an external factor such as workplace children distance you know family siblings you know someone taking care of a parent or parents someone that's working three jobs plus in being a single parent and lives you know 2000 k's away that's kind of a third party in my books anything that is an external factor that is causing separation between two that is an external factor and that is a third party um so and it may in some cases probably you know 10 percent of the time it may be another marriage or or person that is involved you know maybe even an ex that's still hanging on and so on and so forth but I feel that there is an external factor between the two of you whether this person's come in yet or not that is you know a deciding factor and you're waiting waiting for this to clear up okay because it moves into the zero and the zero is a complete cycle it's completed it's over you're starting a new chapter here this is a brand new gateway so this is a tower moment this is going to be released not this person or this but this the decision is a, a gateway to a new beginning that makes you start again all right because the other situation didn't work out so you're being flung into a new one um and that's not a bad thing i feel it's positive but let's see how it clarifies spirit please clarify the tower here with daughter romance for taurus please clarify the tower here with daughter romance for my gorgeous taurus this moo two two double numbers again uh so two two um perhaps you both have uh, some kind of extra extra um, situation going on in the background because two two that's two and two it could be kids it could be distance it could be work like sorry I can't meet up because I've got work and I work seven days and I work three jobs blah 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 you know what I'm saying so it's like official person this is my person they're straight and narrow they like to do it by the book because they're official okay could even be a fire person or a police person or someone that works by the law uh, this is something that is um, by the book someone straight and narrow you know someone that likes to do things the right way every time you know uh, official person tower moment so I'm going to look into that a bit deeper spirit what is official person in tower again we have courthouse with divine feminine and she is the two two three somebody's getting a divorce so someone's still in separation here um, and they're doing it the right way they're doing it by the books coming towards the divine feminine so or this could also be the divine feminine still has to sort out some official business coming out of the courthouse um, and there is a divine masculine or divine feminine here that is still sort of coming at the situation um, waiting for things to process here okay daughter romance is sparking those so we've got deep feelings here so we're working on knight of wands 
could be a workplace romance again man holding a coin working and in the meantime this person is fast moving energy okay fast moving energy they're coming at you quick action very fast moving changes okay changes someone's world is falling apart spirits saying and i feel that it's the one that's going through this okay um and the divine feminine is probably you know i'm getting the feeling that the divine feminine is not but i might be wrong because the energies are interchangeable here so but i feel more so the divine masculine is going through a separation and making it official and they've recently found the spark with the divine feminine and the divine masculine is going through a really tricky time right now but you know the energies are interchangeable so you can correct me in the comments below spirit please tell me more about the knight of wands here thank you there we go wealthy man man holding a coin okay so the pieces fit here taurus this person is coming at you um, or you're coming at your divine feminine if you're the gent if you're this person here so this is the the <laughs> knight of wands could be a fire sign because it's wands wands are fire aries leo sagittarius um queen of wands here so she could be the fire for the divine masculine so tell me about queen of wands please thinking man this is the one that um is thinking about this person uh and the challenges that they're facing so concerned uh queen of wands is concerned for mature man here uh um, energy that's been around her for a while so like i said possibly the both of you are going through some kind of situation this could be an ex and they're trying to take it easy on the the divine masculine is trying to take it easy on the ex is quite harsh towards them um taurus if you're the divine feminine you'd be the sunny side up and um sunny side up beautiful attractive gorgeous mystical um feminine is thinking of the difficulties as well as um somebody in their past i'm going to clarify who this is spirit please clarify mature man for my taurus Clarify your man for my Queen of Wands here. Clarify. Thank you. Uh, moving on. So this is someone. Um, Queen of Wands is leaving the mature man um, for a new beginning. Spirit, can you clarify wealthy man for Taurus? For my divine feminine. Clarify wealthy man you this is the king of pentacles like i said well uh the man holding a coin has the king of pentacles energy as well as knight of pentacles two of pentacles taking his time because he's still dealing with the juggle of life uh still juggling uh the past and the present okay still moving from one to the other you know moving from the new love and trying to temperance the the ex okay um and moving into something positive but needing time in order to to be able to make these changes okay so let's get the romance angels and get some more um messages for you my beautiful and handsome taurus spirit tell me more about this so express your love very soon someone's going to be making their feelings very obvious very soon it's going to happen quick and it's going to take you by surprise but it's going to be amazing and i feel that it's for the long term 178 meaning infinity all right taurus it's taken forever sorry that i'm getting longer and longer with your videos i hope you enjoyed it if you liked it please like it and i send you love always bye for now